We tried to make a pumpkin ferment itself twice. We tried to make a coconut ferment itself with less than adequate results. And as summer approaches, it's only right we try this once more using a watermelon. I found that this racking cane was just the right diameter to hammer in a hole for our airlock. Looks good. And we're gonna pour in everyone's favorite D47 wine yeast. Just, you know, right into the watermelon. I'm hoping that these aggressive little guys will crawl all around inside this watermelon and turn it into delicious watermelon wine. You know, just out here turning water melons into wine. And then our airlock goes in very, very carefully. And we'll fill that up with some clean water. How long do you think I should let this sit? I'm, I'm thinking a month, two months? You think it's gonna eat through the bottom of my watermelon? Let us know in the comments.